Another quick vid of another uh, JB76 uh, just done up. This guy uh, came with an incomplete power supply here. Those parts you see right there, that uh, resistor on top of that capacitor and that uh, big white resistor there and that diode in the back uh, didn't come in this power supply and also the two blue wires the one connected to that resistor and the other one goes over there to ground they were sitting on top and uh, not connected to anything uh, it was like a incomplete uh, power supply and those parts um, go to the negative bias so this amp as I got it um, didn't have any negative bias this is a high serial number yeah, let me turn it off and oh, don't see the serial number on the back. There it is on the side. 7114. So it's one of the later ones, and I don't know if it was unfinished or you know what happened. Um, but anyway, we uh, recapped it and put uh, four high voltage caps across there where there normally was two. And the reason we did that is with the higher voltage that um, modern AC uh, you get out the houses nowadays, um, um, it was 125 volts coming out the um, the power line. And when I fired this up on the 125 volts house line, I was getting about 930 uh, volts DC out of that um, power supply. And the two original caps in it were 450 volts times 2 is 900 volts. So it was overvolting the capacitors in it. So we put four of them in there and some heavy duty uh, bleeder resistors because that's what we had. And upgraded a few of the parts. That big power resistor is upgraded. And that uh, zener right there in the back has been upgraded and changed all the caps. And this originally had some old looking 6L6 tubes and once I fired it up it didn't do a lot with them it did about half maybe a hundred watts peak so I went through the um, trash can in the back and I found two 8417 new tubes I had so uh, these are GT uh, newer batch made in China probably but anyway they were new so we stuck them in there and now she does what she's supposed to do so we're gonna fire her up right quick enough talking for me and okay we're on the 20 watt scale so no nope, we're on the 200 I'm on the wrong watt meter it's late I'm sleepy so forgive me um, 20 watt scale on that one about one watt audio about six that's all going into this thing and going to turn it on and put it on the 200 watt scale and right there she's dead key in 30 or so swinging a 150 uh, audio talking about 125 hello audio um, that's on average and we gotta put it on peak audio and over 200 there let's go on the 2000 watt scale back on peak audio audio about 240 or so on peak audio audio and that's about what she's supposed to do there's a tuner in the back and I could dial it more but these are supposed to dead key uh, 30 40 watts and um, swing the 200 peak and that's what this does plus some with the brand new kit uh, tubes in it did a lot less with the uh, old tubes so that's gonna be about it the, this uh, refurbished JB 76 Amplifier. Bye.